Hi Libra, you need to know this right now for January the 31st through February the 1st, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra for January the 31st through February the 1st, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra. For January the 31st through February the 1st, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Libra. For January the 31st through February the 1st, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. You guys, subscribe to my new channel, Omega333 Tarot. That's Omega333 Tarot. Thank you so much. I appreciate your support, Libra. Libra, these are your cards, honey. So, Libra, you have the two of wands. Aries, Leora Sag. This is you being at a crossroads, needing to pick a path between two. Should I, shouldn't I? Will I, won't I? This has been coming out a lot today. So, Libra, you're at a crossroads, needing to decide, needing to pick a path here. Clarify the two of wands for Libra. Clarify the two of wands for Libra. Clarify the two of wands for Libra. It is clarified with the chariots. Could be dealing with a cancer, but you're determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. Now, this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But you're determined to move forward confidently. So, Libra, could be dealing with a cancer, but you're wanting to make some type of move here. Clarify the chariot. For Libra, clarify the chariot. For Libra, clarify the chariot. For Libra. It is clarified with the page of pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now, this can be the news about an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value. This is the news or message of it. So Libra, some type of news about practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or commitment. Clarify the page of pentacles. For Libra, clarify the page of pentacles. For Libra, clarify the page of pentacles. You jumped out of my deck. Clarify the page of pentacles. For Libra, clarify the page of pentacles. For Libra, clarify the page of pentacles. For Libra, it is clarified with the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. So listen, Libra, could be dealing with a Pisces, but you can tell me that you're in the dark concerning something. You can tell me that you're using your intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon for Libra. Clarify the moon for Libra. Clarify the moon for Libra. It is clarified with the six of wands. Aries, Leo or Sag. This is getting attention, getting recognition, rising above the crowd, getting the accolades, the pats on the back, being triumphant, getting the victory, victory and success. But this can also speak to something being brought to your attention or you're beginning to recognize something or you're getting attention and recognition. So Libra, they could be getting your attention. You could be getting their attention. You can tell me that something is being brought to your attention. You're beginning to recognize something here or this is an announcement being made. Now Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're using your intuition concerning maybe some type of trip or a journey here. 
some type of travel, maybe an invite to travel. Libra, you can tell me that something is being brought to your attention. You're beginning to recognize something concerning some type of secret here. Could be about practicality or a commitment. And you're trying to make a decision on, on which way you want to move here. Because you're wanting to make some type of move. Libra, you have the Knight of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is someone rushing into you or you're rushing into someone. Demanding truth. Demanding clarity. Speaking your truth. Spewing facts with direct, harsh communication. Now, here's where truth comes out. It's swift. It's bitter. It's harsh. It's direct. It's almost confrontational. It's where you can't get a word in edgewise, but it's truth. So, Libra, some type of confrontation happening here. Question and answer session. Someone setting the record straight. Someone getting to the bottom of something. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Libra. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Libra. Clarify the Knight of Swords for Libra. It is clarified with the Hierophant. Could be dealing with a Taurus, but the Hierophant speaks to the leader of a religious organization, the leader of a metaphysical organization. This is a clergyman, a pastor, a preacher, a teacher, a coach, a mentor, a counselor, someone of wise counsel. This is the institution of higher learning. This is a corporate institution. This is the marriage card. So Libra could be dealing with a Taurus. You guys may be in a commitment. Someone may have commitment on the brain. This can be about forgiveness. This can be dealing with an institution, organization, governmental agency, religious differences, or values. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra. Clarify the Hierophant for Libra. It is clarified with the Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is a brand new opportunity of something more solid, stable, and secure coming into you. Now, this can be an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value, brand new practical beginnings. So Libra, some type of opportunity of practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or commitment. Now Libra, it just seems like you're having to get some type of straightenings here. Some type of understanding here concerning commitment here. Because it's on the board and you're needing to make a choice here using your intuition. Or this is about practicality, dealing with some type of institution, organization, governmental agency, work, or business here. There's a confrontation taking place because you have unanswered questions or you're here to set the record straight. Libra, you have the Ten of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is emotional fulfillment. This is the Apex card. This is the happy family, happy life, happy wife, happy, stable, committed relationship, and happy home. This is what we're all striving for. So we're speaking of marriage, commitment, home, family, emotional fulfillment. So Libra, someone very well may have commitment on the brain, but in tarot, tens are ending, so it could be ending to you guys' commitment, marriage, living together situation, or family dynamics. Clarify the Ten of Cups for Libra. Clarify the Ten of Cups for Libra. Clarify the Ten of Cups for Libra. It is clarified with the Six of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone from your past. Flashback from the past. Full-fledged in the flesh. Someone from your past is back. Now, you can be reminiscing on someone from your past, remembering someone from your past, but something or someone from the past is being revisited. This is twin flame energy. This is reconciliation energy. So, Libra, listen, you can tell me that you're having feelings of nostalgia, wanting to reunite with this person from your past. You can tell me that someone from their past is in the picture, someone from your past is in the picture, something from the past is being brought back up here, or this involves children. Now, you can tell me that someone from your past is wanting to reunite and have this commitment. Commitment is on the board here. You can tell me that something from the past was brought back up that caused you guys to end, or you're realizing that someone from their past was in the picture, and this may have caused you guys to end but i feel like they're wanting to reunite and they're speaking on commitment here libra you have the six of swords gemini libra aquarius this is moving away to calmer waters moving away to a place of peace so either mentally or physically you're wanting to move away 
And this can speak to if you guys had any type of disagreements or arguments between you. Agreeing to disagree. Letting bygones be bygones. And moving away to a place of peace and harmony together. Or this is you saying you just want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. So Libra, you can tell me that you're physically moving or traveling. You can tell me, hey, let's just put it behind us and move away to a place of peace and harmony together. Letting bygones be bygones. Or you're saying you just want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. Clarify the Six of Swords for Libra. Clarify the Six of Swords for Libra. Clarify the Six of Swords for Libra. It is clarified with the Knight of Swords again. So some type of confrontation happening here. Question and answer session. Someone setting the record straight. Someone getting to the bottom of something. Clarify the Knight of Swords. For Libra, clarify the Knight of Swords. For Libra, clarify the Knight of Swords. For Libra, it is clarified with the Eight of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. This is you detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. So Libra, you can tell me that you're walking away, detaching emotionally, but when we're dealing with the Eight of Cups, this is someone who's leaving in search of their Nine of Cups, their wish fulfillment, and oftentimes they find that the grass is not greener on the other side, so they end up returning. So you could be walking away or returning. You know, Libra, when I look at this spread here, it makes me feel like you were primed to walk away, to leave, to just get out. Maybe some type of secret is being brought to your attention here, yeah. Like you wanting to leave, but it's like someone is stopping you from leaving and they're speaking on commitment. They're wanting to reunite and go into commitment here. So you can tell me that you're done, you're having this confrontation, you're leaving, you're moving out, moving on, moving away from the relationship. But I feel like someone is confronting and trying to set the record straight, hoping that you return and accept this and just put it behind you and move away to a place of peace and harmony together, letting bygones be bygones. This is what puts you at a crossroads on what you should do and how you should move. Libra, you have the Four of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. There's an offer on the table that you're not accepting or rejecting. You're contemplating this offer, but actually you're bored with the offer, thinking of missing the offer. But this is also a card of you contemplating sending an offer, but you fear that the offer will be rejected. So Libra, very well could be an offer coming into you that you're thinking about missing. However, you could be contemplating sending an offer. You just have this fear it won't be accepted. Clarify the Four of Cups. For Libra, clarify the Four of Cups. For Libra, clarify the Four of Cups. For Libra, it is clarified with the Four of Cups. Hmm, an offer that you're thinking about missing. Hmm. <laughs> this is someone trying to stop you from leaving, Libra. It's like you're already packed, you're already at the airport, ready to catch a flight, and they run through the airport proclaiming that they love you, trying to stop you. This is an example, okay? Someone is trying to stop you from leaving. I'm going to take a look at the situation ship for you, Libra. And this is just additional messages here. You guys, subscribe to my new channel, Omega333 Tarot, Omega333 Tarot, thank you, and it says, drastic, extreme, harsh, cutoff, drastic, extreme, harsh, cutoff, where you think you're going, Libra, you're not going to get very far, they're chasing you, what else, for Libra, what else, for Libra, and it says, intervention, rescue, others involved. Intervention, rescue, others involved. Oh, so they're enlisting others to chase you down and keep you from leaving. Their mother, their brother, their sister, their cousin, their auntie, your mama. <laughs> if you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Libra, you need to know this right now for January the 31st through February the 1st, 2024. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share, and follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Maj, M-A-J, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.